Why, hello there. Welcome back to Minecraft Dinosaurs. I hope you're all well. You're already seeing what's happening and you're already like, oh no, not another one. However, <laughs> it's episode 301. I think, what a great way to start it other than going to the nether. Um, I need to find new areas because I definitely always head this direction and go that way. So we're going to just try and go to a new... Oh, wow, that was easy. Oh, wow, that was really easy. Okay, we're going to probably die. Nope, I controlled my descent. <laughs> the objective of today is everyone loves it. Everyone knows it. It's quartz. Um, the next couple of episodes, I'm going to be getting as many quartz and other items in the nether as possible that will have a, a use case because we're going to be continuing the railway. We'll then fit in a build at some point, return to the railway, and then we'll move on to bigger stuff. But for now, I want to get the railway pretty damn close to finish, if not 95% of the way there. Um, so once it's finished, we can then start thinking about expanding it to go to other locations, locations we've got currently unlocked, and I say unlocked, but built upon or built near, and other locations we've not yet scratched the surface of. So, oh, I dropped myself a little bit low there. <laughs> so yes, we're going to be doing this for a little bit. Appreciate it's not the most exciting thing in the world, however, you do get to see me get stuck on stuff quite easily um but you also do just get chatting time and i do appreciate these episodes i really do enjoy the adventure aspect of it on some occasions oh there is some magma let's be careful don't exactly want that in my inventory although it is a fun little block to build with partially because it kills people <laughs> like every good home defense needs magma right i'm uh yeah i'm kind of excited because every time we get to like the end point so like a 300 350 400 whatever right there's like an obligation to make sure it gets much done as possible you know condense time don't show off so much resource gathering having to take forever just to get a few videos done and it's a pain but also i don't get to go and do exploring stuff like the minecraft side of minecraft dinosaurs and i do appreciate it you know so i'm glad to be back doing this as laborious as it might seem and i appreciate that but one thing I love in any video game, it's the grind. <laughs> God, I sound like one of those hustle bros, don't I? I'm on the grind. No, I think they would cringe if I heard them, myself use the word as it was intended um, in a video game. <laughs> but no, it's it, it's a lot of fun. I know I went right past what I would consider very easy to access glowstone, so let's go fix that. I'm using my a diamond axe because it has silk touch. And that is a big boon. Um, speaking of, let's get rid of all of these magma blocks because I'd rather not slowly murder myself. Might grab them, to be honest, but we'll see. Let's just grab all of this glowstone because it has a use. We use so much of it. <laughs> so we may as well grab some more. I am looking forward to the next big build. It will be a pirate's cove. Um, and it might be quite a big build, so it might extend all the way up to episode 400. So don't expect it to be done by 350. I'd just like to get a little bit more of the world filled in that we've currently got before I start something too new. And we've not even got close to finishing urbanization, which we'll probably do before the big build, but hey, there we are. Ah, this is just a bit of fun, just a bit of gathering. And I will do a bit of gathering off camera still, don't get me wrong, but I think just keeping it on camera just means I don't have to, like, spend hours and hours of off-camera time, which is a big way to get burnout for a series and i'm aware of that so yeah plus we just get to chat about things and the great thing is if you join the discord and create a really fun conversation the chances are my brain will remember that so as i'm sure you're aware when i was live streaming on twitch because i'm sure you all follow me on there and watch me right <laughs> if you're not i do live stream on twitch pretty regularly at least once a week um you can find the link to it in the description i have recently it will be done by the time that this video goes live but it's not done by the time i'm recording it i have recently or will be in my time have done in your time um oh uh, i can make it um done a 24-hour stream and i plan to do a lot more like that because it was a lot of fun or it will be a lot of fun <laughs> i'm expecting it to be um it's all for charity as well so it should be a good crack i need to get all of that sorted tonight after my bout of recording so eh, busy couple of days for me ahead but 
I appreciate it just being able to effectively do everything I need and want to, which is nice. Oh, I had a phone vibration. There's a person at your garden. No, it's a Nimbus, I'm sure. Right. He's um, become enamored with a chair in the garden. <laughs> just goes out there and just lies on the chair in the sun it's like okay we get it you're basking little beautiful little boy just basking right i don't know how much quartz we need but i always always grab so much and then feel like it's not enough so i've bought two em now empty shulker boxes and they are going to work overtime because good golly it's going to be a lot of effort now, do I think we're going to have to grab two shulker boxes full of quartz and the quartz blocks, not the quartz? Yeah. Is that going to take a while? Yeah, also texture pack. Well, does it actually say? I don't think I've read that. Minecraft equals fire hashtag east false. Cool. <laughs> I don't think I've read the rest of it, but I don't need to. I could try and grab... No. No, that would be beyond stupid. We're not going to go and try and grab that one. Now, unfortunately, we are going to get back into the realms of areas I've probably explored based on that nether rack right there. Oh, look, a single block. <laughs> so we do have to keep that in mind and that. I definitely remember that. So we do have to try and reach new heights, new locations. Let's have a look. Over there looks pretty good. So let's let's do what they call in the business a really stupid item. That looks really good too. But that looks unattainable. It doesn't fit into my current goal, which is do something really, really stupid. So, come with me as we try something really stupid. How high do we think high enough is? I think about here. Cool. Oh, there's some there too. Oh, and up there. Oh, look, look. don't look at the ceiling. There's no point. We're going to try and reach over here. Okay, up. Up. And we're going to just start circling the drain. And up. Okay, that was significantly easier than I thought. I probably could have made quite some distance there if I chose to. Oh, oh, that is the hurty block. Let's grab it. Ow. That's not the hurty block. That is the killy block. So let's avoid that. Yeah, that, the, the, the amount I got over here doesn't feel nowhere near as significant as what I could have got over there. <laughs> Do I fly back and forth constantly? Absolutely not. We just keep going until we find areas of where we have not yet explored and just get as much quartz as possible. Because everyone loves quartz. And everyone loves it when I go quartz mining. I know I know this. <laughs> hey, I'm aware that some people like putting the videos on and just having them run through, you know, a couple of episodes at a time just to catch up. Um, and just falling asleep to it. And I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Also, I am dangerously hurting myself, but it's fine. We're in peaceful. None of my armor's breaking too much, is it? Nope. Okay, cool. I need to get mending on all of them. So I do need to make a trip back to an ender city at some point. Because I don't think you can get mending in any other way. Oh, but that's fine. Just because, like, with, with the amount of mining I do, getting XP just fixes it. As you can see, the elytra is fully fixed. So. It does make quite a difference, it would seem. Ooh. A little bit more. Why not? I am picking up netherrack as well, and we absolutely do not need as much as we're gathering, but hey, it's fine. What we'll do is we'll aim for a full inventory of quartz, condense it down, and then dump it immediately in one of the ender chests, not ender chests, shulker boxes. The reason we do that is for one strong reason only. Oh, the pickaxe could do with a fix at some point. Eh, it'll be fine for now. Um, one reason and one reason only. It allows me to go reclaim everything to that same amount of inventory again, which is nice. I am trapping myself like a mole rat. Okay, right. That's fine. Oh, more, thank God. <laughs> I was about to say, so far, this trip over here may not seem worth it, but it's starting to look like that flight or um, of doom had a purpose. There is some down there, but I don't quite know how much. It looks like only four. It doesn't seem like it's worth the drop. Don't get me wrong, I'm fully aware that there'll be 100% more sense in just, like, gathering every single block I see until I don't see it anymore. But then in the future, if I come this way and I don't want to have to make a massive journey and I just need a little bit, it is good just having some within reasonable grasp. You know? If I strip mine the entire nether, which I would love to do, it could be quite... 
well, it'd be a long process. <laughs> God, could you imagine just spending an entire, like, 50 episodes just strip mining the, the nether? I can, and the worst part is, and I'm going to say this, and you're not going to enjoy my answer, I think I'd enjoy it. <laughs> but it's fine. Let's just get as much as we can. With as minimal effort as we can, I can see that perfect amount right there. I don't think I can make this jump. Nope. But we gave it a good try, and that's all that matters. No, when you're jumping lava, trying doesn't matter. Missing is definitely a problem. As we can clearly see by the fact that I'm still on fire. How's the armor looking? Eh, it'll survive. Cool. All we're doing right now is just grabbing every single item I can possibly carry. And I don't think we're super close. Ooh. That looks like a new texture. What are you? Hang on. Wait, no, it's the exact same thing. Have I just not been paying attention to the textures for this? Clearly not, because it looked completely different to normal quartz. I'm, I'm so confused. And yet, I'm sure if I looked at every single quartz actually properly, it would look like that. Right. I'm going to try some surgery here. This may end in tears. Okay. Oh, that's not the, that's the, not the, that's the solid stuff. Okay, cool. That's not the solid stuff. That's not the solid stuff. <laughs> oh, I never claimed I was a smart man. I think um, if you ever need like to win an argument against me and just highlight I'm stupid, if I say when have I ever been stupid, you can clip that. You can 100% clip that and say, case in point, this feels like I've explored this part. I don't know why. I hate the fact that I'm in literal hell and I'm, I'm recognizing places. I'm like, oh yeah. I know this corner. <laughs> Getting too familiar with the literal Minecraft hell. Right, stop, 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 stop. Ow. Okay, get on top of this, because that hurts. Funny that. Magma hurts. Actually, I don't know if it would. Like, I think from a certain distance it would hurt, because it would sting as your hair burns. But, like, as you get closer, your nerve endings can get destroyed immediately. So, I don't know too much on the pain receptors and how they'd react to lava and magma. Be quite frank, if I can go my lifetime without finding out, I'll be a very happy man. <laughs> I think um, most people don't want to find out that question, you know? Oh, I've definitely been around here. There is some absolute clear signs that a quarry has wandered these hallowed halls because of the amount of damage to the local scenery. <laughs> uh, yeah, but it's fine. We, we clearly missed a bit and it follows the same rule and mantra before of just don't get everything that you can possibly grab because you want to leave a little bit for future you and it's a good mindset to have it would seem all right let's grab all of this digging up in the nether is never usually a problem digging down can be but up unless you're like really low down isn't gonna be a problem um sometimes there are just random lava pools and random lava waterfalls that you might dig into just remember the magic thing when it comes to lava it's quite slow and it's very territorial so, if you show that you're not a threat to it, okay, for legal reasons, that's a joke. Please don't try and square up against love. <laughs> I've just got images of someone going, ah, it's territorial. If I show I'm no threat, <laughs> damn, Corey, you betrayed me. Yeah, well, it was a joke. Please don't. <laughs> right, let's grab all of this. I think, I think we've got to be getting close to the end, right? of one full stack of inventory. Eh, actually pretty close. Oh, 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 oh I almost glided away. I almost missed what's right in front of me. Nice. How long is, oh my God, this has been about 15. This is what the usual average episode is like for me, 15 minutes, but I'm, oh. I'm not gonna make it too short while we're doing these. I know I'm extending resource gathering, which isn't always a great thing. I'm sure you'd rather have longer episodes of building or seeing dinosaurs, but. It's sort of my way of making it back and making it up to you guys having to deal with literal adventures. And a lot of you be like, well, why didn't you just use creative again and not have to do this? Because I don't like using creative for stuff. I only use it in builds when I absolutely am tired of it. <laughs> and that is rare for most builds. Like, if I keep falling off an item or, like, getting back up, I will use creative to fly. If I need to do water, for example, and flood an enclosure, I can't be bothered to deal with sand and all that malarkey. Or de-flood an enclosure, I should say. 
that's a little bit more of a pain. Right, we're actually going to go up. I don't usually do this for um, quartz because it's effort, but this almost seems like it might be worth the effort just based on how big the absolute node is. It's kind of crazy. We're already up to 103 level-wise. I think we dropped a bit for other stuff we were gathering, so this is kind of nice. Um, but other stuff we were enchanting. The name tag, I think, took a level off first. That was it. So that we could have Phoenix, the Flaming Kiwi. Which, funnily enough, is going to be one of my badges on Twitch once I get those sorted. Now, what is over there before I even contemplate flying to it? Okay, it seems worth it. <laughs> yep. Uh, rude. It's gonna... Oh! That's handy. That was an unintended consequence of my destruction. Okay, let's get a little bit higher just so we can grab this, because a lot of it is falling down. I'd like to grab it while I'm here, you know? Can he make the jump to that? Yeah. Easy squeezy. Right. The reason I did that was so that I could create a larger jump. And I know there's a little bit that's dropped off, but not too much. Ooh, that bit over there is nice too. Oh, wait, no, there's ma magma underneath it. That was it. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we're good. That was for a second there. I felt like I was losing too much altitude because I couldn't go up without hitting the ceiling. Owie block. Right, okay. See, when you see the loads like this, where they're just all on the outside, there's rarely ever a dive into it. Like, it doesn't go deeper. Oh, I think we've hit the limit. Okay, can't just shift-click that. That's a shame. Right. Let's go all of them, and then we will dispose of them. Uh, the other blocks, effectively. Apart from the nether right, which we'll, we'll keep. There's, there's a lot of blocks in here I don't need. Can I spawn a kiwi in here? They're smart enough not to run into magma, so I think I can. Oh my god. Wait, little guy, be careful! Oh. Oh. He's okay. There's solid ground down there. See? He's fine. They can live in this cave together. Maybe not. Yeah, they're fine. They, they, they know what they're doing. It's alright. Um, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I got distracted. But eggs just meant I could use them. The little kiwis are okay. Also, I realized they reacted so purely without you being able to see it because I don't have the camera on anymore. And that was, um, I was shocked. <laughs> Completely dumbfounded. Right, uh, let's just split these a little bit more. And there we go. Right, so, you're going in this one. Throw all of this in here as well as this and this because I will keep that and a little bit of that. And then what I'll do is I'll get rid of the rest of these blocks. I don't need the fish. I don't need the netherrack extra. I don't need that. I'll take half of this off, actually. Because I think that's probably a good idea, just so that we can keep to one stack. The fishing rod I didn't really need to bring with me. Or the paleopedia. Because we've got so much space that we're just wasting, effectively. But it's fine. Oh, there we go. And got this back. And this is... Which one? Cool. It's in the right order now. Okay. We continue. Being very careful about which blocks we get and when because because of that that is not liquid though so we're good is that liquid i thought i saw flowing i was clearly wrong <gasps> that's liquid okay i'm sure this will be absolutely fine because i created a hole right there just need to be on fire for a little bit it's fine yeah, it's fine you know everything's fine <laughs> you've seen that meme <laughs> this is fine everything's fine I thought that was going green for a second. I was like, did I just make a radioactive kiwi on accident? But no, it's just a optical illusion from the fiery pits of hell. <laughs> Who'd have guessed it? Hell messes with your mind. Not me. But apparently so. Right, what else did I have on me that I don't need on me? The torches we're keeping. I'm not bidding torches. I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I bin torches. I go, why haven't I got any torches? And I will hate myself in the future. <gasps> Mother load. Right, let's grab this. And then what we'll do is we will um, start to wrap up the video. I think 20 minutes is pretty reasonable. It gives me a chance to record more of this tonight. Um, as I'm sure you're aware, basically Minecraft Dinosaurs comes out every three episodes of Paleo Pines. And currently I have recorded... I've lost count. Is this four? I think this is four. Let me just double check. One, two, three, four, four. So that gives me an opportunity to get 12 
episodes of Paleo Pines done. I think we have five currently, plus seven would be, you know, a little bit more to go. But I want to get as much of this done as possible so I can get as much Paleo Pines done as possible. Hopefully taking us all the way up to the Paleo Pines anniversary. I'm not sure if we'll get updates before then. If we do, we'll do obviously a showcase. You might not see the new content. Hell, we've still not got to the Sarcosuchus yet <laughs> in the, currently in Paleo Pines. It might have already hit it for you by now because this, I think, will be after those episodes are released. So we're fine. I also tonight have to get other stuff done. Loads of stuff, which is good because I finished my most recent Vatan model. So I will get finishing the other ones but i'm just wanting to get everything done at the moment and it's just so much content to do i can enjoy my time with my war dollies once everything's said and done but for now let's just get as much minecraft and as much paleo pines recorded as possible oh hello i dropped that was a small drop. Right, it is very warm, by the way, in the UK, so I've been taking regular breaks for water and... Oop, hello, that's a drop. Let's be careful. Let's grab you while I'm here. Should just go straight in my inventory. Uh, we will be up another stack of netherite, uh, netherrack, netherite, whatever, shortly. So, I, was, I said I was going to end the video and I didn't. <laughs> Right, I'll start ending the video now. So if you have enjoyed today's video, please make sure to do some hoosh the like button down below. If you want to subscribe to more guys' videos, I super duper appreciate it. My name's Radiko, you can call me B. Thank you all so much for watching. Have a nice day, and ta -ra.